When we hear about midlife transitions, it's often in the context of women going through menopause. However, men also experience significant hormonal changes during middle age, a term sometimes referred to as andropause. Andropause, much like menopause, can bring about a range of physical and emotional changes. In this video, we'll delve into the concept of andropause, exploring its causes and symptoms and how men can navigate this important life transition. I'm Jo Banks. I've been a professional executive coach for almost 15 years and I'm sharing what I know. What is andropause? Andropause, often called the male menopause, is a term used to describe age-related decline in testosterone levels in men. It typically occurs in middle age, starting around late 40s to early 50s, but it can begin earlier, like early 30s for some men and for some later, later 50s. Unlike menopause in women, andropause is much more of a gradual process as testosterone levels don't drop suddenly as estrogen levels do in women. Understanding hormonal changes. To understand andropause better, let's take a closer look at the hormonal changes involved. Firstly, we have testosterone decline. Testosterone is the primary male sex hormone responsible for various bodily functions, including muscle mass, bone density, red blood cell production, and sexual function. As men age, their testosterone levels gradually decline. This decline can lead to a range of physical and psychological symptoms. Some of these symptoms can actually get misdiagnosed in men and that's why it's so important to have this conversation. Oestrogen's role. While oestrogen is typically associated with women, men also produce small amounts of oestrogen, primarily through the conversion of testosterone. As testosterone levels decrease, the oestrogen to testosterone ratio may increase, potentially contributing to some symptoms of andropause. Common symptoms of andropause. Andropause is a multifaceted condition with a wide range of symptoms. It's important to note that not all men experience these symptoms and their severity can vary from person to person. But here are some of the most common symptoms of andropause. Fatigue and low energy. Men with andropause may experience unexplained fatigue, low energy levels and general lack of vitality. Mood changes, mood swings, irritability and feelings of sadness or depression can be associated with andropause. Hormonal changes play a role in these emotional shifts. Many men may be misdiagnosed with depression and anxiety when actually it's the reduction of hormones producing the symptoms. Forgetfulness. A reduction in testosterone can cause memory loss and forgetfulness, which can mimic early onset Alzheimer's or dementia. Obviously, this can be extremely distressing for anyone experiencing it. Reduced muscle mass. Declining testosterone levels can lead to a loss of muscle mass and strength. Men may notice a decrease in physical performance and endurance. Increased body fat. Andropause can contribute to increased body fat, particularly around the abdomen. This change in body composition can affect self-esteem and overall health. Changes in sexual function. Reduced libido or sex drive can be quite common. If you're experiencing any dysfunction in any of that area, I would always suggest that you speak to a healthcare professional. Sleep disturbances. Sleep problems such as insomnia, disrupted sleep patterns, 
may become more and more common during andropause. Some men report difficulties with memory, concentration, cognitive function during andropause, and these changes are generally mild and may not affect everyone. Bone health concerns. Declining testosterone levels can increase the risk of bone density loss or osteoporosis and fractures in older men. One really good way to combat that is resistance or weight training. Again, seek medical advice before embarking on any new exercise regime. Coping with andropause. Navigating andropause involves adapting to the physical and emotional changes it brings. And here are some strategies to cope with andropause effectively. Seek medical evaluation. If you suspect you may be experiencing andropause, it's essential to consult a healthcare provider. A doctor can assess your hormone levels and recommend appropriate treatment if necessary. On this point, if you are suffering from anxiety, depression, low mood and lethargy, I would always suggest that you demand, if that's the right word, a blood test to get your hormone levels checked. Many doctors and the experience that I've had speaking to people about andropause, many doctors just give out antidepressants or anti-anxiety meds without even considering that it might be a hormonal issue. So one thing that I would very, very strongly suggest that you do is if you suspect that you might be going through andropause, it might be your hormones that might be causing this, that you demand a blood test rather than just going along with what your doctor or healthcare provider might say to you. I know that might be a bit controversial, but I've seen it happen too many times not to know you should fight for your rights and get that blood test if you think it's necessary. You can always seek a second opinion as well. Remember that. Very important. Testosterone replacement therapy. In some cases, testosterone replacement therapy, TRT, may be prescribed to address low testosterone levels. As HRT, hormone replacement therapy in menopausal people, helps address low estrogen and sometimes progesterone levels, TRT can help alleviate some of the physical and emotional symptoms associated with andropause. Again, this is why visiting your doctor and asking for a blood test is absolutely critical. Lifestyle changes. Maintaining a healthy lifestyle is crucial during andropause. Regular exercise, a balanced diet, adequate sleep, getting outside in daylight and fresh air can all mitigate symptoms and improve overall well-being. Psychological support. Seeking support from a therapist, coach, or counsellor can be really beneficial, especially if you're experiencing mood changes or emotional changes during andropause. Communication. Open and honest communication with your partner about the changes you're experiencing can help maintain a healthy relationship and address concerns related to intimacy. Stress management. Effective stress management techniques such as mindfulness, relaxation, hobbies can all help reduce feelings of anxiety and irritability. However, increased drinking, increased alcohol consumption will make all of those things way worse. So just be mindful of the amount of alcohol you're consuming. The wrap up. The andropause is a significant life transition for men that's often overlooked or misunderstood. While it shares some similarities with the female menopause, andropause is a distinct experience with its own set of symptoms and challenges. It's essential for men to be aware of the changes that may occur during andropause and seek appropriate medical guidance. By understanding and addressing the physical and emotional aspects of andropause, men can continue to enjoy a fulfilling and active life as they age. With the right support and strategies, andropause can be manageable, allowing men to maintain their physical and emotional well-being throughout middle age and beyond. For more information on menopause, which if you have a female friend, partner, aunt, mother, sister, I highly recommend watching my video, 
how to support someone going through menopause. If you'd like help or support navigating andropause or you simply want to boost your relationships or career, visit my website joebanks.net for more information on the coaching services I provide. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe and hit that notification bell so that you don't miss a thing. As always, thank you to everybody who stays until the very end and thank you so much for your continued support. It means the world to me.